name is Jose Moreno and I welcome you to this course. I am a 3D artist for video games and I will be guiding you along this exciting process. In this course, we are going to learn all the fundamentals and the necessary techniques to create from scratch high quality models for next generation video games, using two of the most powerful programs in the current industry, Blender and Substance Painter. The course is divided in three chapters. In the first one, we are going to see all the concepts we need to know to understand the process of the creation of the models for video games. Also, we are going to see the fundamentals to get familiar and work fluidly in the programs that we are going to use. We will see a navigation in the interface and the most important tools of the programs. So, this is a perfect chapter to start if you don't have previous experience with these programs, or if you want to improve your current knowledge. The second chapter is the practical phase, and this is where everything becomes really exciting. And in this chapter, we are going to create, step by step, these five amazing biking objects. We are going to start with the easier one, and then increase the level gradually to make this process fun and easy to digest. We are going to create a bear mug, a war horn, a viking shield, a combat axe, and finally a helmet with a ringed chainmail. Using Blender we are going to create the high poly models using different methods depending on the needs of the objects. Then we will create the low poly mesh optimized for video games, we will continue with the UV unwrapping and then finish with the maps baking and texturing with Substance Painter. Along this chapter I will give you the files of the models, so if you only want to do the texturing process, you will have the necessary material to do it. Finally, in the last chapter, we are going to upload and configure the models we created in several different engines, like Marmoset Toolback, Unreal Engine, and Blender. This is the second version of the course. The first one had a very good welcome with more than a thousand students around the world. So I have decided to update the course with a new interface of Blender 2.8, taking in mind the feedback of my students and improving the workflow and the final quality of the models. This course is for beginners to intermediate users, and it has more than 10 hours of content. Before taking a decision, I invite you to watch the free material of the course and you realize that this course is really for you. Thank you for your interest and I hope to see you soon in the course.